Burnley County finally has an offer for an empty old jail downtown. A developer says he wants to turn it into an apartment and it's the only bid. But Action 7 News reporter Matt Howerton explains why the county still isn't biting. It still stands tall, but the old county lockup in downtown Albuquerque can't do what it was built to do house inmates. The building is in bad shape and in serious need of repairs. No one's used it for nearly a year, but the county is still paying up to $85,000 a year for it, a cost it doesn't want to keep paying. The county has looked to sell the old jail, but no one has stepped up to buy it. I think if anyone can do it, we can do it. Until Doug Peterson. I reached out to the commissioners uh, via email and said, I'd like to take a look at it. Peterson says he'll buy the jail for $1,000. You heard right, $1,000. He says it would make great residential space and save the county from spending millions to tear it down. Peterson does admit, however, making his vision a reality would be a big challenge. What you have to spend to make that habitable uh, is pretty significant, almost the cost of, of rebuilding a new building. County Commissioner Wayne Johnson still believes the county should sell rather than demolish the building. The $2.5 million that we were going to spend on that uh, deconstruction, that demolition, we have that in the bank. We keep that. Though he'd like to get more than a thousand bucks for it, Doug Peterson doesn't expect the county to take his offer, but he does think it'll prove to commissioners that this old building has a lot of value. Matt Howerton, KOAT Action 7 News.